Lord, thank you for your unwavering love and faithfulness. Thank you for the precious gift of prayer, through which I can pour out my heart to you and find solace and strength in your presence. Tonight, I meditate on the words of Philippians chapter 4 verses 6 to 9, and I lift up my voice to you, knowing that you hear and answer the cries of your children. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6. Lord, you know the burdens that weigh heavy on my heart and the worries that consume my thoughts. Tonight, I surrender them all to you, knowing that you are the one who holds the universe in your hands. I choose to trust in your sovereignty and your perfect plan for my life. Help me to cast all my anxieties upon you, for you care for me. 1 Peter chapter 5 verse 7. In this quiet hour, I bring before you my deepest concerns and desires. You alone can bring comfort to my troubled soul and bring about the solutions I seek. I pray for divine wisdom and guidance in every decision I need to make. Grant me discernment to distinguish between what is temporary and what is eternal, what is of this world and what is of your kingdom. Help me to align my desires with your will, surrendering my plans to your higher purposes. I am reminded to bring my requests to you with thanksgiving. Tonight, I offer my gratitude for all the ways you have blessed my life. Thank you for your unending grace and forgiveness. Thank you for the countless blessings I often take for granted. The gift of life, the air I breathe, the provision of my needs, and the relationships that bring joy and support. I acknowledge that every good and perfect gift comes from you. James chapter 1 verse 17. Teach me to have a heart of gratitude, even in the midst of trials, knowing that you are working all things together for my good. Romans chapter 8 verse 28. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Philippians chapter 4 verse 7. Lord, I long for your peace that transcends human understanding. In a world filled with chaos and uncertainty, grant me a calm assurance that comes from knowing you are in control. May your peace reign in my heart, guarding it against fear, doubt, and anxiety. Help me to fix my eyes on you, the author and perfecter of my faith, Hebrews chapter 12 verse 2, so that my mind may be steadfast and my heart anchored in your truth. As I rest in your peace, I pray that my mind be filled with thoughts that are noble, pure, and praiseworthy. Philippians chapter 4 verse 8. In a world saturated with negativity and impurity, may my mind be a sanctuary of righteousness. Guard me against the lies and deceptions of the enemy, and help me to focus on whatever is true, honorable, just, pure, lovely, commendable, excellent, and worthy of praise. Transform my thinking and renew my mind according to your word. Romans chapter 12 verse 2. Lord, I ask for the strength to live out the principles of your word. May my life be a living testimony to your love and grace. Help me to put into practice all that is good and true, knowing that faith without works is dead. James chapter 2 verse 26. Enable me to be a light in the darkness, reflecting your love to those around me. Empower me to extend forgiveness, show kindness, display patience, and demonstrate self-control in every situation. Let my words be seasoned with grace, uplifting and encouraging those who hear them. Fill me with your spirit, that I may bear the fruits of love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Galatians chapter 5 verses 22 to 23. Lord, I commit myself into your hands tonight. I surrender my fears, my worries, and my plans. I trust that you are working all things together for my good, even when I cannot see it. Strengthen my faith, deepen my love for you, and mold me into the person you have called me to be. I pray for the needs of others as well. I intercede for those who are suffering, whether physically, emotionally, or spiritually. Comfort the brokenhearted, heal the sick, provide for the needy, and bring hope to the hopeless. Use me as an instrument of your peace, that I may be a source of encouragement and support to those around me. 
Thank you, Lord, for hearing my prayer. I rest in the assurance that you are with me, guiding me, and watching over me. I trust that you will lead me on the path of righteousness, and that your goodness and mercy will follow me all the days of my life. Psalm chapter 23 verse 6. In Jesus' precious name, I pray, Amen.